This is a video about how to convert a non-OCR PDF into an OCR PDF so that students can use the text-to-speech function in Read and Write. So here I have a PDF. I opened it from my Google Drive, and now I'm going to go ahead and open it with Read and Write because I want to use the text-to-speech function. And I'm going to see that this is not possible because it's a non-OCR PDF. And here you see this message right up here. It's telling me cannot see any letters. So this is essentially a picture. It doesn't recognize the individual letters. However, we can try to convert it to an OCR document so that it can be read. Now, with Read and Write, you can try and use the screenshot reader. If you go ahead and click on this and select a word or two or a sentence, it will sometimes read it to you. Excellent. So it depends on how clean the document is, and it depends on the amount of text. So it's not a great option for a lot of text, but it can work with a small amounts of text. Well, let's see if we can convert this to an OCR type of PDF. So in order to convert this, I need to go into VDI mode, because that is where Adobe Acrobat is located, and that program is what will allow me to convert it. So I, I go to this, if I want to do it on the web-based version, I go to view.northport.k12.ny.us, and I go ahead, and I'm actually going to do it this way. I'm just going to do it through my browser. So I click on this, and I log in, and now I'm in VDI mode. Okay. So in VDI mode, here is the actual document um, that I had a problem with. That's non-OCR. I want to try and convert it. So I go ahead and go to my Programs menu. And I open up Adobe Acrobat Pro, not the reader, but Adobe Acrobat Pro. That is the one that does the conversion. So I opened it up here. It looks like this. And now I'm going to go ahead and tell this Adobe Acrobat Pro to go ahead and open this document right here. So I go to Open. And here it is on the desktop. I open it up. Okay, so it's opened in Adobe Acrobat. Now I'm going to come over to uh, Document menu here and go down to OCR Text Recognition and over to here. Recognize text using OCR. So let's go ahead and select that. And I want to do all the pages. And I click OK. And this may take a few minutes depending on the size of the document. Okay, so it's done doing the conversion. Now I'm going to save it in um, a slightly different, with a slightly different name. So let's just call it uh, Instructed Response, and then I'll put OCR in parentheses. So I can differentiate the two, and I'll go ahead and save it to the desktop. Okay, and let's, I can close this now. So now I have two versions. I have my uh, OCR version and my original non-OCR version. Okay, so I moved that OCR version into my Google Drive. I reopened it up again, and you may notice I'm not getting that error message that I got before. So here's the other one, the non-OCR, and I got that error message. So the new one doesn't give me that. And uh, it, even though this isn't the cleanest PDF, it will still read. So if I select this sentence here and go here, it was right when we got back to Boston. Okay, you get the idea. So that's one way to do it. Now, you can also, know, now that it is um, OCR, you can copy and paste this into a Google Doc, which may be even a better idea. So if I select this story here, right-click and copy it, and then I go open up a blank Google Doc and paste it in, right-click, paste. Okay, now I will have to tweak it a little bit. So here's the title and the byline, okay, like so. I can change the text if I want. I need to look and make sure that um, there are no problems in here, like maybe this quotation mark is not quite what it should be. So you, you will have to, if it's not a clean copy, you may have to go in and tweak it a little bit. But now, read and write will work very well with it. If I turn it on here, turn my extension on, and go ahead and ask it to read, it was late one evening when we go back to Boston. Okay, and it will read the whole thing. And um, that may be the better option, because once you have it in a Google Doc, you'll never have that issue again. 
So that is how you convert a non-OCR PDF to an OCR PDF and then ultimately into a Google Doc, if that makes sense for you.